What's going on, everybody? It's Wade here again, and uh, this month, I'm here with something a little bit different. As you might have heard in the vlog that I did, I'm not doing Loot Crate anymore because of uh, one thing or another. Ooh, dinner time. Yeah, there was that. And uh, also, just the objects in them, uh, kind of last couple, three months, uh, weren't really to my liking, you know? I mean, there were a couple good ones in there, but mostly I was just like, eh. So I figured I might uh, subscribe to a couple different services and cancel that one, and subscribe to a couple more that kind of suited my interests a little better. And uh, one of them is this right here. It's called Horror Pack. It's basically where they send you four horror Blu-rays every month. Um, they're random. They're a mystery until you get them. Um, and, uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, they give you hints on their Instagram every month as to what the four movies might be. Um, they also do DVDs for people who don't do Blu-ray. So if you wanted to do DVD, four random DVDs every month, horror DVDs, uh, you, you have that option as well. Um, and I think it's four different movies, too, from the Blu-ray ones, obviously. Not everything that's on DVD is on Blu-ray, and not everything that's on Blu-ray is on DVD. Although I'd say most things that are on Blu-ray are probably on DVD, so... <laughs> fuck me for that analogy. So yeah, let's open this up right now. And then we'll hit, we'll, uh, we'll hop into the, uh, the clues that I was talking about earlier. This knife wasn't as strong as I thought, but just kind of spent that right there. Okay. Uh, like I'm a brain surgeon. Yes, yes. Getting in there. It's coming along nicely. Now, as a lot of you might know, I'm a huge horror fan. Like, I love, love, love horror movies. Um, so this is right up my alley, honestly. I'm pretty excited about it. It's the packaging we got here that they're all in. Nice bubble wrap. Smells bubbly. Let's get this fucking box out of here. Um, I'm not gonna open them yet. Like I said, they do have some uh, hints on their Instagram, so I'm gonna read those off right now. Right first. Uh, right first. I don't know. I'm gonna read those off right now. Uh, the first one was uh, ingredients: Sin City, The Elder Gods, One Bad Mother. Blend until perfectly smooth. Uh, I don't know what that could be, honestly. People are saying they think it has something to do with the Lovecraft mythos, which would be really cool. Uh, the next hint is, uh, when that thing in the woods decides to follow you home. Uh, people in the comments are saying might be a movie called The Hallow. I've not seen it. Uh, movie, movie called Honeymoon. I've not seen it. This is going to be really embarrassing if I'm like, I love horror movies, and then I don't know any of the four movies in here. It's just going to kill my uh, uh, my horror cred. There's two more hints. Uh, one of them is uh, New Town. Check. New Identities. Check. Same old killings. Check. I d still don't know what that is. People in the comments are saying it might be a movie called The Thompsons. Again, <laughs> never seen it. See, this is kind of a good opportunity, though, because this is a chance to watch the movies I might not have seen otherwise. So let's look at it that way, and not that I'm a total uh, noob. Not noob. That's not the right word. Uh, I'm a total not-knower of what these movies are. Last, uh, last hint. Uh, in this screaming sequel, a bloodthirsty regime builds an immortal army. People are thinking Army of Darkness... People are saying Dead Snow 2. Um, I've never seen the first Dead Snow, so if it is Dead Snow 2, I'm going to have to go out and get Dead Snow. Which looks pretty cool. I've been meaning to, meaning to see it anyway. Or I could probably just stream it somewhere. So it's time to unveil... The Mysterious. The Well-Hidden. Horror Pack Blues. Number 1. Okay, I have no idea. That looks a lot like Dead Snow, kind of. It's a movie called Outpost Black Sun. Uh, definitely looks like it has that uh, Nazi zombies kind of thing going on with it, which is looks cool. Kind of cool that, uh, you know, it's not Dead Snow 2 because now I don't have to watch the first one. This looks like, a, uh, well, this is a sequel, though. So now I'll have to see Outpost 1, I guess, or whatever the sequel. Uh, but yeah, this looks cool. 
I'll go ahead and I'll read the description on all the, on all the movies. This is definitely the uh, bloodthirsty regime, you know, sequel, whatever. The year is 1945. The closing stages of World War II and a German scientist is working on a frightening new technology that has the power to create an immortal Nazi army. Flash forward to present day and a NATO task force is deployed to Eastern Europe where a sinister enemy is mercilessly killing everything in its path. But this is no ordinary foe. It is a superhuman army of zombie Nazi stormtroopers. Defying overwhelming odds, a small band of soldiers venture deep behind enemy lines to uncover the source of this evil power and prevent the rise of the Fourth Reich. This sounds pretty cool. Yeah, pretty much the Nazi zombies, kind of like Dead Snow. Uh, looks like it's Scream Fest. Cool. Yeah, that's the first one. This is a Blu-ray plus DVD combo back, too. So, you know, that's two for the price of one, even though I paid one price for four movies. <laughs> I'm all over the place today. All right, here we go. Number two. I'm not sure which hint this will be for, but we'll figure it out when we get it. Oh, God, there it is. Wait a minute. Oh, yes! I love this movie. Stephen King's Sleepwalkers. I definitely think this is the uh, uh, when that thing in the woods decides to follow you home kind of thing. This is a really good movie. Uh, this is probably, you know, it's a Stephen King movie. It was written by Stephen King. Cameos by Clive Barker and Stephen King. I don't know if you can see that there. But yeah, this is a, this is a really good movie. Like, this this right here is worth the entire horror pack oh, altogether, you know? So yeah, Stephen King Sleepwalkers, that's a new movie number two. We're doing really good so far. For my first one, this is awesome. Alright, here we go. Movie number three. This one this one feels like, I don't know if that's just the, uh, I think that might just be the, uh, plastic that's kind of, so it felt like it might have one of those, like, cards on it that have been on, like, the, uh, Walmart releases and whatnot. Here we go. What is it? Badass Monster Killer Limited Edition Blu-ray from Horror Pack. This is a limited edition Blu-ray. I've never seen this movie, but uh, that's cool though. I'm one of the only people to get it because I have horror pack. Um, this definitely seems like it probably fits the uh, Sin City, The Elder Gods, One Bad Mother, Blend Until Perfectly Smooth uh, hint on there. Um, let's read the uh, description on the trip. I'm gonna read this in like a like a real like seventy yeah voice, you know. On the trashy side of Camaroville, there's a mob turf war going down, but the new gang in town ain't content with merely controlling the local dope and sex trade. They are also mixed up with a dangerous black magic intent on resurrecting hideous demon gods who have waited centuries for the chance to eat all our souls and enslave mankind. These blasphemous bad guys need stopping, and Jimmy Chevelle, agent of the Department of Supernatural Security, is just the cat to do the stopping. He hasn't let the man keep him down, and he's certainly not going to let some sinister shape-shifting suckers <laughs> destroy the earth and all of its foxy foxy chicks if he can help it. But he can he stop the gangster cult's evil plans in time? Get ready for a freaky funky horror comedy with demonic pimps, kung fu super foxes, and terrible sanity shattering extraterrestrial terrors from beyond space and time. This looks pretty badass, actually. <laughs> Definitely looks like one of those old, like, black exploitation kind of uh, horror movies. Uh, which looks awesome. I'm really excited to see this because I've not seen this. I've never heard of this before. Um, so, yeah, that's cool. Thanks, Horror Pack, for the uh, limited edition Blu ray. Badass Monster Killer. Alright, that's three pretty awesome movies so far. Two that look awesome, one that I know is awesome. And uh, we're on to number four. So this definitely has to be the new town check, new identities check, same old killing check. Hint. Let's see what it is. The disc kind of like span when I <laughs> did that. That sounded kind of cool. Oh shit! You know what? This is uh, Mama. I've never seen this. I've been meaning to watch this. Like, literally, I was like, here sometime in the next week or two, I need to get this from the movie store. But, uh, no need now, because we got it on Blu-ray. Wait a second. Hold on a second. So, I, I think this is the, when that thing in the woods decides to follow you home. 
And the new town check, new identities check, is sleepwalkers. I don't know why I mixed that up. I knew that. I knew that. Gotta keep that horror cred. I knew that. <laughs> um, so I just saw uh, The Conjuring 2 uh, twice. <laughs> and so uh, I gotta say, it's a really good movie. Check it out if you haven't. If it's still in the theater when you're watching this. Uh, or if it happens to be on Blu-ray when you're watching this. But yeah, it's a great movie. Um, there's a character in that movie um, called the Crooked Man. And it's actually played by the same guy who plays Mama in this movie. Uh, I think his name's like Javier Bote or Botet or something like that. Um, he's got like Marfan syndrome, so he's got like elongated features. So like they always use him for like, you know, monster roles and whatnot. But yeah, that's just kind of a little connection there. Uh, yeah, this looks really good. I've heard good things about this movie. I heard it's really creepy, really well made. Um, you know, G Guillermo del Toro. You can't go wrong with that. Well, okay, that's yeah, that's the four Blu-rays for the month. I'm really happy with this. I'm definitely gonna keep doing this horror pack thing every month because, I mean, you can't go wrong with four horror Blu-rays every month. I mean, seriously, <laughs> this is like Christmas for me right now. Um, just to recap what we got in case you missed, in case you uh, forgot about it. We have Mama. We have Badass Monster Killer, which I've not seen. A horror Pack exclusive. Thanks, Horror Pack. Stephen King's Sleepwalkers. Excellent movie. And Outpost. Black Sun. Dead Snow. The Kmart Edition. <laughs> I don't know. I, I, I shouldn't say that. It might be a really good movie. Yeah, that's horror pack for you. Uh, four awesome horror Blu-rays every month, or four horror DVDs if you want to go that route. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. I'll probably have another video soon because I also subscribe to Horror Block, which is kind of like Loot Crate, but with horror stuff. So thank you for watching. I, as always, will catch you on the flip side.